Standout contestant on Tough as Nails is a Sacramento native and a Good Day viewer. Felice Ortiz is live with her this morning to learn what she's been up to since she appeared on that reality competition show. Hey, who? Hey, good morning to you. You know, I will take any excuse to be able to hang out with my dear friend Meryl Tankers. I feel pretty lucky that I can call you a friend now. It is so <laughs> great to see you. It was so fun watching you, of course, during Tough as Nails. So that's how we got to know her, right? And of course, check out her dance moves, too. Uh, <laughs> but what have you been doing since then? Since Tough as Nails, yeah. I came out with a book yes. back in 2022. Uh -huh. uh, three weeks ago, audiobook. Um, my daughter is adopted now, yes, so yes. Oh, family of congratulations. Four, and just oh. been doing more speaking engagements yeah. for like Fortune 500 companies, for schools, yeah. everything. So it's kind of just kept going, and yeah. I've just been going with it. I love it. Oh, good. Well, we're so glad to hear it. You mentioned the book. Here it is called Shatter the Sky, um, Colonel Merrill Tengel Skull. And so what's the story? Is it kind of your whole life story? Yes, yeah, so it's my story for how a girl from the Bronx growing up in the 70s became the first and only black woman to fly the U-2 aircraft. Yeah. So I talk about, it's broken up into four parts. So mm -hmm. for people who don't like to read, if you like Instagram, you'll like the book because it's <laughs> broken into little vignettes. If you like Instagram, and you'll like so the book. so it's, it's really easy bite-sized chunks so to go good. through. So I talk about my time in the Bronx growing up yeah. and then my Navy days, yeah. my Air Force days, and then after I retire, what I'm doing now. So I do personal training yeah. still. I have people, I have clients come to my house and yeah. I do that privately with them and yeah. it gives me more time to just do everything else. And do everything. I, the bite size, that works for people like us. Right? Yeah, definitely. Tina, Cor, like yeah, we have the right? attention span like of this much. Exactly. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so she literally just released the audio portion. Um, how was that actually reading what you wrote? It was, it's read by me, so I will tell you that was a whole learning curve. Uh -huh. I went to um, San Francisco Outpost Studios. Thank you so much. They were great. Had a great engineer, Carl. Yeah. Um, we we did it in about five sessions. Yeah. And did you do any ad libbing? No ad libbing, but I did add some stuff to the book. Oh. So where in this book, music it centers around music that grounds me. Mm. So I wrote some lyrics throughout my life, and eventually I, I put it to music, and it was just thought pieces. Oh, I love it. So don't judge don't my judge. vocals. Don't judge my okay. vocals. Okay. I, I convinced her to let us hear a little bit. Oh, okay. good. Oh, my gosh. When she said, I wrote some lyrics, I'm like, what? Okay. I, I did, and I put some music to it. Okay. Again, people don't judge me. Well, tell us where, what we're about to hear. This is called, uh, it was about a student okay. when I was an instructor. He really frustrated me because he quit the program because oh. he didn't get jets. Oh. So I can't, I couldn't, like, yell at him. Oh. So I just wrote a song about it. Wrote a song about it. Want to hear it? Here you go. I wrote a song about it. It had a real 80s feel. Oh, yeah, that's an 80s feel. <laughs> I like it. What is it? Oh, my God. I mean, <laughs> you have so many layers. I feel Yay. like I learn new things about Meryl every time I <laughs> hang out with you. I absolutely love it. Oh, my goodness. All right. It is a Shatter the Sky, of course, on paperback, but also available as an audiobook as well. Yeah, you can buy it on Amazon, um, iTunes, and Audible. So you can get it there. And uh, mm -hmm. Amazon for the book or where books are sold, you can buy it on demand. So okay. I'm excited about that. Of course, that. she was wearing her Dragon Lady from, uh, of course, Tough as Nails, which yeah. is about to get going here, season five. Yeah. Season five will air uh, July 2nd. Mm -hmm. So if you love the Dragon Lady shirts, different colors, <laughs> All proceeds uh, go to Mission 22, mm -hmm. so that's a veteran organization, and partial proceeds of the book go to Legacy Flight Academy. Why so not? we're trying to help and yeah. inspire and yeah. motivate people. Well, you are. Anyway. You certainly have inspired and motivated all of us, so thank you so much. Great to see you. All the information and, of course, links to all of that on our website, GoodDaySacramento.com. I'll send it back over to you. I'm telling Don't you. Don't frustrate her. She needs T-shirts that say, if you like Instagram, you'll love this book. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is great. That is great. Me too.